The Air Force had a show and the Army had a show. They were big, big hits. Now, the Navy was, no, we don't do that. So the Coast Guard said, hey, we would like to do a show. And they did. They got it together with Howard Dietz and the man who wrote the music was uh, uh, Vernon Duke, Alexander Dukowski. Alexander Vladimir Alexander. Anyway, anyway. <laughs> so uh, he said, and he knew me because we worked together. You know, he was in the band. He, he, was, he was the man who put the band together because he was, he, was a, uh, he was about 40, 45 years old at that time. But he was very patriotic and he wanted to be in. And when, we do, when I met him at the base, he couldn't drill because he, he couldn't see. He was, and he was too ashamed to wear glasses. So I used to pull him by his collar. <laughs> He'd follow my collar, and I'll, when we we'll go about face, you, I'll give you the signal which way to go. <laughs> and we got along that way, and we did put the show on, and it was a very big hit, and uh, the Coast Guard put on the show. <clears throat> and uh, that's where I met Max Liebman. See, one thing runs into the other. And Max had just finished a picture with uh, Danny Kay called Up in Arms, which was a big, 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 big hit. And, uh, and I did a thing called the airplane number, you know, and I did sketches and I did this and I did, it was all around because I did sketches in the, in, in the, in the, in the, in the country, in the, in the Catskills. I did Waiting for Little Lefty, Waiting for Joe, Waiting for the, you know, all the, all the, all the, the socks, you know. I had all the, the all the old, old burlesque sketches, so I was trained on those. So uh, all of a sudden, uh, we, I was picked. And the way it was done was very... I was at the base, you know, I'm staying at the base, and then the, the word is out that the Coast Guard is going to do the show. And we don't know, you know, and nobody knows who's going to be in it. And that, they got the pick of the entire Coast Guard, you know, not just. So uh, Lieutenant Silverman gets a, 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 a letter from Washington, and it says, you will send Seaman First Class Sid Caesar, Sidney Caesar, uh, number 646717, to Palm Springs, Palm, no, Palm, Palm Beach in Florida, as he will be in the show. And he said, he called me in, he said, I have never, I've never seen an order from Washington for one seaman. One admiral, two admirals maybe, 10,000 men if you want 100,000, but one seaman? Never, he, he, was, he kept looking at it, he said, I'm gonna frame this. I never saw an order to come from Washington for one seaman first class. And that was it. I went down there, and I uh, rehearsed for the show, and the show went on. And then when we played Philadelphia, that was where we, uh, the home of the, uh, right near Washington. So Weishi, uh, Admiral Weishi, who was the commandant of the, of the Coast Guard, came down to see the show. And that was like, wow, the commandant? Boy. And after the show, we, we all got to meet him, you know. And he said, how would you like to be in a movie? We're going to make a movie. I said, what? And from that, I went in, I, did, I toured with the show, and uh, from that, we, we came here and we made a movie. And the wonderful thing about it was, the great thing was, when we got here to make the movie, there was a strike. The grips went on strike. All Hollywood, you couldn't, nothing moved. So we had to sit. And we sat here for nine months when the strike was on. And the war was going on. And I was saying, I hope they strike forever. <laughs> <laughs> and sure enough, it was, uh, you know, it was, uh, it worked out perfectly. The timing, I mean, luck, again, is luck. Fate, luck, you meet certain people. But the one thing about luck and fate, you have to be prepared for luck. You know, luck can come your way, you know, you win a, you win a, a lotto, you win this, or you go here, you know, get a break. <clears throat> you get a job, you get this, but you have to be prepared. If you're prepared, and you get the break, then you got a chance of making it.